So you've learned how to do a back stitch, a running stitch, and then we've ended with a back stitch. So now you could just cut your thread off like this. Put your needle into a cork or put it to the side. I put it in a cork so it doesn't get lost. And there's your beautiful sewing. So it looks like that and like that. Really cool. So now I'm gonna show you how to sew two pieces of fabric together. So again, keep your hand under the pieces you're sewing together. So I've just folded it in half. So start with a back stitch, go down and up, pull through, leave some thread hanging out, and then just go back through the hole you went in, back out close to the hole you came out, pull that through, and you have a knot called a back stitch, your best bud. And I like to do two back stitches just to be extra secure. So there we go. So now we're gonna sew two layers of fabric together and make sure you have your hand behind the second layer. If you didn't have your hand there, you might end up just throw, sewing a bunch of layers together and you might not want that. So just hold together the ones you want to sew and we can start doing a running stitch. Down, up, down, up and now pull the needle through. So now we have two stitches done. I'll try another running stitch. Down, up, down, up. And pull your needle through. Very cool. So now that we're running out of thread, when you only have a little bit of thread left, you want to tie off your sewing. So before you completely run out of thread, you want to make sure that you've done a back stitch to hold your sewing in place. So we're going to do a back stitch now. Just take a step back from the last hole you came out, go down, and then come out in a hole close to the last hole you came out. Pull that through, and that's a back stitch. I like to do two, so again, you just go down and up behind your last stitch, pull through, and that's very nice and secure. So now all we need to do is take some scissors, snip that off, put our needle to the side, and we have these pretty stitches. So now we've sewn two layers of fabric together, you can see on the back there. Looking beautiful. Oh my God, you know how to sew. How good does that feel? I'm so excited, keep practicing, Show me your stitches, show me what you got, and now you can pretty much sew Cinderella Sew Designs, which is so exciting. I can't wait to see what you make. Good job. Wasn't that so easy? It's crazy. You know how to sew, you know how to sew. Be so proud of that, because that is a really good skill and a really big accomplishment. All right, love you, bye. You know how to sew, how cool is that?